Though microscopic robots have been feasible for some time now, they often need direct external control to even function. However, researchers at Cornell may have found a simple solution. Micro-robots, no more than 250 micrometers across, with simple electrical brains have been developed. Allowing them to move on their own, two- and six-legged robots have relatively straightforward motion, whereas a laser pulse from an operator may alter the pace of a four-legged dog bot. The secret was to construct a CMOS, complementary metal oxide semiconductor clock circuit, the signal of which generates phase-shifted square wave frequencies that determine the robot's platinum-based stride. The circuit and the legs are managed by photovoltaic cells, although it has just 1,000 transistors. To put that in perspective, a GeForce RTX 4090 has 76.3 billion. Its size makes it sufficient to function as the robot's body. Even so, that's quite a feat, since Cornell's very low power requirements prevented the installation of comparatively massive photovoltaics. To showcase the CMOS integration, the team built three different robots, a two-legged Purcell bot named after the physicist Edward Purcell, who proposed a similarly straightforward model to explain the swimming motions of microorganisms, a more complex six-legged ant bot, which walks with an alternating tripod gait like that of an insect, and a four-legged dog bot whose walking speed can be adjusted using a modified circuit that receives commands via laser pulse. These inventions pale in comparison to the modern, autonomous, large-scale robots. They can advance, but that's about all. The scientists just consider this to be the first step. Some experts think that in the not-too-distant future, micro-robots will play a key role in healthcare, particularly in areas like internal surgery and artery cleaning. They could be able to identify substances and get rid of pollution elsewhere. While fully autonomous robots are still years away, this research shows that the technology is there to make them a reality. That's it for today. Let us know what you think. And as always, make sure to like, subscribe, and check out our website at www.techwiki.co. Thanks for watching.